Our budget-friendly meals we continue today with a recipe for matzo ball soup. We uh, love, love matzo it. ball love soup. It. It's like Absolutely. actually a two-course meal for mm -hmm. only $1.80 per serving. Here to take on our chef challenge are the authors mm -hmm. of this book, Bromberg Brothers. Is it Bromberg or Bromberg? Bromberg. Bromberg Brothers. Blue Ribbon Cookbook. Better Home Cooking. Welcome, Brother Bruce. Eric Bromberg. Good to see you. Welcome to hey us. Welcome Bruce. to the show. So much. Eric, How are you? nice to see you guys. Great to see you. So it is like two courses. All this for $1.80? Per serving? Per serving. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Unbelievable. We okay. utilize the chicken uh, from making the broth, yeah. so we actually just serve that as a delicious meal. How about okay, that? so let's talk about uh, the ingredients. Uh, let's start with the chicken broth first. What's so in that? In this bowl here, we have all the ingredients that go into the chicken broth, which is carrots, celery, parsley, onions, garlic, a little bit of bay mm -hmm. leaf, and some black pepper. We put that in a pot of water with a whole chicken, Cut up into eight pieces, mm -hmm. wow. and we just simmer that for about 45 minutes to an hour. We take the chicken out at that point, let the chicken set, and then we'll finish cooking the broth for about another 15 minutes. Oh, it smells delicious. Okay, smells and great. then the dry ingredients, the so, matzo, right? That's the key. Uh, so for the matzo, for the matzo balls, we're going to start with the dry ingredients, which are the matzo meal. Uh -huh. Okay. And then a little bit of kosher salt. Right. And baking powder. Got it. And at the same time, we're going to mix those. Okay. Give you those. Thank you. And then maybe you guys can help me. We're going to sure. take oh, four that. eggs, and we're All just going to lightly beat the eggs okay. just to break them down. Lightly. I'm just oh. kidding. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. And then kind of the secret ingredient is chicken schmaltz, which is rendered chicken fat. But to make real schmaltz, it needs to be cooked with onions. So you cook oh onions goodness. and the skin of the chicken, a little bit of the fat of the chicken, and it Gives us this delicious Pour it in. There you go. fat. Is which there a is substitute a, if you don't have? If you don't have. You can probably schmaltz? just omit it, or a touch of olive, olive oil. oil. Could, okay, okay. Could also work. I got schmaltz in my schmaltz. Oh, you can yeah. schmaltz. <laughs> 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 it, it happens. <laughs> oh my God. All right, so that's perfect. And okay. then we're just going to mix that right into okay. here. Okay. Good job, Spencer. The way ingredients right. into the dry. Did know I spilled it? Okay, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, that's it. I got. I just got schmaltz as well. <laughs> so then we just mix this together, mm -hmm. and then once it's incorporated, we're going to actually add a, the, the other secret ingredient, which is club soda, or oh, seltzer oh. water. Oh, seltzer water, yeah. What does and that that's, do? That's kind of the, the grandma's okay. secret. Oh. It basically uh, gives you the fluffy, light, delicate matzo balls instead gotcha. of the dense ones that... Okay. You can't no, break. Now like that's what it looks lighting. like after you stir it up, right? right? So that's it stirred and it's been sitting in the fridge for about 30, uh, 30 minutes to an hour. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then Eric is going to show us how you make the perfectly I'm going to do the messy job. Balls. Here we go. Okay. So it, the, the keys to matzo balls are we need to have a wide top pot. Got it. About halfway full of water. Got it. And just at simmer. As you can see here, it's just bubbling. Right. Okay. So you get wet your hands as well as possible. With cold water? With cold water. With cold water. Okay. I'm going to form a little bit of the matzo batter into my hand, roll it into a ball, and then very gently drop it into the pot. Oh, they expand that much? And they, they will, will expand, expand oh over the double baking their powder. size. Yeah, the baking powder and the club soda are going to give you that light, fluffy How about the ball? Oh double the size. When right. And you want to keep, keep adding uh, additional water to your hands so you can keep the ball smooth and they right. don't stick to your hands. How and the fun. shorter time they spend the fun process. Yeah. in your hands, the nicer your matzo balls will come out oh. on really? the outside. Okay. Yeah. Now, you guys have uh, the Blue Ribbon restaurants in New York, right? Right. We now have nine locations. We started in 1992 on a little 50-seat restaurant on You've Sullivan Street in Soho. Oh, my goodness. Congratulations. And now we're, yeah. Now, it's exciting. What kinds of dishes? Are, are all, the restaurants different? The restaurants are all different. The original restaurant was really kind of an American restaurant. Then our second restaurant, we have a Japanese partner and sushi restaurant. And we have a bakery wow. and I like that. Wine bar. Japanese restaurant. Yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah, it was uh, <laughs> we were just always so fascinated with Japanese cuisine, and for chefs, it's just such an amazing yeah. genre of cuisine. We it love really it. You guys should That's open amazing. a restaurant on the West Coast because well, we your dad's here, right? He lives right. in California. Yeah. You yep. actually brought your whole family. It's Everybody's like, I love out. it. I love yep. it. It's a family Everybody's affair. Out. Your other brother, uh, Eric's Eric wife, and kids, your dad, his wife.
Love it, love it, love it. So we're getting closer. Dad's been pushing for yes. some years now, and you know, we've got when, enough in New York. The city's amazing. The city, I mean, just in a couple days, we've been out here. There's so much fantastic stuff in oh, San yeah. Francisco, and maybe like New York, everyone is utterly passionate about the food. That's true. Inspires we really are. Us. Yep. Yeah, and we're absolutely. doing an event tonight with uh, Renaissance Hotels at the Stanford Court. And again, it's that's just the people who we've come in contact with out here have just been so passionate about what they do. And right. Yeah. It's a great thing. So, oh, Eric, let's talk about the next step because I'm yeah. dying to try this. We got to yeah. try it. Okay. So, what, you let so, it simmer? So, our matzo balls, you can see they start, they rise to the top once right. they've, they've begun to cook. And you know what? They take about 45 minutes to cook. Right. And you know when they cook, you can see it comes to the top and they'll float to one side. Okay. If you flip them, they'll float back to the uh, same yeah. side. Yeah. You know it? when they're cooked, Still when they fully oh. roll. Yeah, fully roll, yeah. Uh, and you have no resistance in the roll, okay. and then they're ready to go. Yeah. Okay. We're going to take them out, put them in a separate container, store them in the refrigerator overnight to cool, and then we're going to add them to this strained, oh. strained broth strained that we broth. have. And we have nice oh, the clear broth. broth. Okay, yeah. okay. While That's you're doing great. that, tell us about your chicken nuggets. Oh, yeah, chicken nuggets. Well, we hey, have a too. spectacular new product. Naked nuggets. Which are called Naked Nuggets. Right. And... They are available all over the country, except maybe the Bay Area right now. <laughs> oh, man. We're in, What's we're up? You're depriving us. In Costco stores in Southern California, we're hoping to move north. And they are simply the healthiest, most delicious chicken nugget ever made. And it's all natural ingredients. They're fully cooked and grilled. Not breaded, and not fried. Not breaded, not yeah. fried. Yeah. Nothing but good. You guys have a couple like, book yeah, signings sure. coming up also. Uh, 12 noon uh, uh, book signing cooking demo. At Williams Tomorrow, Sonoma. At Williams Sonoma. You have to Union sign Square. up. The space is limited. Yep, on Post yep. Street. And, and then, then on Saturday, Saturday at Omnivore Books in San Francisco Admiral? at 3 p.m. on Saturday. Yeah. This is great. Well, well we're so excited. You've got the Blue Ribbon Cookbook, Better Home Cooking. Mm. I gotta get a piece of the monster. Oh my go goodness! Oh yeah, ball. let's go for the monster. <laughs> These are they. I can't believe how mm. big they are. Not so light. not so man. No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, <I love> it. <laughs> it's great, guys. Thanks so it's much delicious. for having us out. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Oh, sorry, Bruce. Nice to meet Recipes you. The blue ribbon Check out. The